Hey everyone, Hobby Reflections here on a Sunday evening. So, not often I do Sunday evening videos, but you know what, decided just to get some extra content here on a Sunday. Um, National Hockey Card Day was yesterday, so uh, pretty exciting for uh, everyone taking part. I unfortunately didn't take part because I had other stuff to do. And uh, my budget has been tight, but uh, I'll be getting some of those cards later on. And I can always get cards in the future as well. Uh, the, the Nathan McKinnon, Joe Sackick were the main ones I'd want. And uh, the U.S. had Cal McCarr, and they had uh, the Colorado Avalanche mascot. So I need to track those down at some point. But uh, yeah, enough of that. Let's get to uh, showing some cards. So we have two of the pristine uh, Dollarama pack, so 80 cards in each, 160 cards to go through, should be exciting, so as you can tell right there, there's a next in line, uh, Brett Howden from Overtime, Zach Prise, and uh, on this one, it's a Danny DeKaiser and Logan Couture, so let's see what these uh, hold in store, and I have some top loaders there, you never know what you might find. Uh, just wanted to show you this card that I found. This is kind of cool. It's a Michael LaRock, uh, former Montreal Canadian goalie, 74-75 Opeachy rookie. Uh, bit off on the centering, but I just found this one lying around, so it's pretty cool. Goes for five bucks or so in the Beckett. Pretty nice uh, little find right there. And uh, yeah, so I got to go through my collection. I, I keep saying that, and I'm just slacking, but. I think I'll be making a push on going through everything and uh, sorting cards for sale and all that. And I'll probably start up eBay uh, again. So, anyway, hope you're all having a fantastic weekend. Let's get to some hockey cards right here. So this is pack one right here. And, oh, that's a cool card right there. Okay, never mind. Uh, just a base, but we'll see now momentarily. So here's a Brett Howden, overtime next in line. Marcus Kruger. Uh, Devante Smith Pelly. That's cool. Dylan Dubé, uh, next in line. So we got two next in lines. Uh, Brett Howden and uh, Dylan Dubé, right there. So just some inserts for uh, a cheap binder for a future card show. We have Ed Jovanovsky, Daniel Sedin. Black Diamond, that's pretty cool. Daniel Sedin, Black Diamond from uh, 910 Black Diamond, yeah. There we go, that's pretty cool. Jonathan Taves, uh, I believe that's a second year card. That's pretty nice. Jonathan Taves, let me focus in on the cards right here. John, Johnny Taves. Uh, Rick Nash from MVP. We have Mike Lute. Uh, these are pretty much garbage at this point. Uh, the Bowman cards, unless it's like a big name. There's Mike Vernon. Tony Granato. Quad as well. I've seen these so many times. Is that another press release? Uh, we shall see. No, never mind. Um, okay, so. No, it's not. Okay. So we have Yurke Lume. There we go. Shane Stevenson, Patrick Flatley, Eric Desjardins. That's a nice uh, action shot right there. Harry York, Dunruss Preferred. So I thought this was one of those uh, inserts, but it's uh, Dunruss Preferred of Harry York. Ed Belfort, the rookie year. Uh, that's from 99-2000 McDonald's. Uh, yeah, Ed Belfort in his uh, rookie year. Ed Ronan, Bob Beers. Flip these around. Some, uh, Greg Scott, Rick, or Ryan Toshe, Mike Palano, it's all junk. Kevin Stevens, uh, score rookie. That's pretty cool. Tony Granado, Brian Leach, uh, season leader from 92 score. Pretty cool. I always like the. I always thought these scorecards were kind of cool with the grayish, bluish border. Craig Mooney and Bob Kudelski. Moving on to the next uh, 
section of these. Uh, let's flip these around. We have Zach Parise, Dave Boland, Tim Thomas. That's pretty cool. Tim Thomas from uh, Certified. Panini Certified. E1112. Always uh, like those cards. We have Ron Ron Hextoff from Tops. Uh, Sergey Fedorov, uh, Chuck, Team Chuck does cards, so nice one right there. Sergey Fedorov, uh, with an artist painting. Al McKinnis, right there. Al McKinnis, Chopper. UA Krupp, Gary Roberts, Jonathan Chichu, Brendan Morrill, Anton Volchenkov, Brian Gianta. Gianta right there, the purple uh, Buffalo jersey. Log uh, Patrick Marlowe, Contenders. And that is, uh, yeah, Panini Contenders from 10-11. Uh, 10-11 Contenders, so pretty cool, like a season ticket. Uh, Tyler Johnson, Glenn Wesley, Gary Roberts, Joey Mullen, Dave Snugrin, a Vinny LeCavier uh, from Premier Plus. These were also cards that I collected when I was young. Uh, I remember this when it first came out. Premier Plus. Um, hard to believe that was 20 years ago. That makes me feel old as the hills. But uh, Vinny LeCavier. So we have Jason Arnott. Gary Smith. That's pretty cool. I, I really uh, enjoy these, this set. Uh, I'm sorting through my cards now, and I'm going to be separating those. And we have Maurice Tchaikovsky from SPX. Let's jump those cards right there. And now let's go into the final stack of uh, pack one. So we have Shane Doan from uh, Ice. Shane Doan. We have more of these. Uh, Chris Clancy, Corville, a bunch of uh, no-name players. Kevin Stevens, rookie. Paul Cavallini. This is cool. Uh, Tim Chauvelet and Kirk McLean, season leader. So for goalie wins. And that year, they had 38 wins uh, total. Patrick Wall was the only other goalie uh, to record at least 30 total. So that's cool. Right there. Uh, Greg Craig Mooney. Bob Kudelski, Peter Sedarkwitz, Andy Brickley, Warren Reichel. I wonder if that is a Warren Reichel uh, rookie. It might be. Uh, I did. Uh, he was on Colorado, so that could be a Warren Reichel rookie. I'm not exactly sure. Bob Beers, Doug Gilmore, Trevor Lynn, and I have this card like ten times over. It would have been nice if it was the Bowman Tiffany version. Stefan Matteau. Murray Craven, uh, Dave Barr on the back, There's some terrible Bowman cards, there we go, don't I sound excited about the Bowman cards, <laughs> Brian Hayward, that's pretty cool, Brian, ha Brian Hayward on the Sharks, Kari Lettinen, uh, between the pipes, first round picks, sorry, let me, uh, yeah, center those cards, Here's a Henrik Zetterberg uh, SP Authentic, and I believe this is uh, not ten, 910 SP Authentic Henrik Zetterberg. Here's a Brody DuPont. And the last few cards Anthony Mantha, Colton Poirier Goal, Carl Soderberg, and Sam Reinhardt. That's my fiance losing her mind in the background. So, pardon her. She's uh, probably having more excitement with her games than I am with these cards. <laughs> On to pack number two. So who's excited for series two? I cannot wait. Uh, I cannot guarantee that I'll be getting a box uh, next week. Uh, I don't think I will be getting anything until the weekend. Uh, if I cannot get a box, I will get some loose packs. Uh, I need to look for Cal McCarr's Young Gun. Like... It's a, it's a given that uh, I'll be looking for Cal McCarr. I still need his Young Gun canvas, uh, so I'm going to probably buy a few 
loose packs of Series 1 as well. You never know. So with that said, let's get on with uh, the rest of this right here. So we have a Denny de Kaiser um, from 15-16. Andre Pavlich. Uh, so Winnipeg Jets, but they were still the Atlanta Thrashers right there. But that's a Winnipeg Jets card. Cole Chevalier. Cole Chevalier. 10 year anniversary. Cole Chevalier from 11 12. Cool. Uh, Glenn Wesley. Mario Lemieux. Can't go wrong with a Mario Lemieux card. Pat Murray. Lamux, says my fiance, says Mario Lamux. Oh, I'll never, li I'll never let her live that down. <laughs> Wayne Presley. And here is uh, Steve Casper, the not so friendly ghost. Here's a. Uh, and as usual, they have their cards either which way. Corey Perry from Ice. That's pretty cool. Uh, 07, 08, UD Ice. Corey Perry. So this is uh, one of the years that they did not have a, uh, an acetate design. Johnny Bauer on the Toronto Maple Leafs. So Johnny Bauer, one of the legends of the game. That's pretty nice. Here's a Doug Waite. Sergei Samsonov. Now there's a name from the past. Sergei Samsonov. Uh, I don't get why they pronounced the latest like goaltender who has the same last name Samsonov. It just sounds really weird. Samsonov. That's what I grew up with. But who knows? That could be the uh, wrong uh, pronunciation of it. So we have uh, some of these cards. The Owen Sound Platers. Cornwall, Wall, uh, Cornwall Royals, and the London Knights. So these are kind of neat cards. Uh, it just has some of the, uh, yeah, these are the rosters. So London graduates like Dino Ciceretti, Daryl Sittler, Brad Marsh, uh, Kirk Muller, and Steve Chasson were on Owen Sound. And on Cornwall, Doug Gilmore, Dale Howardchuck, and Ray Shepard. So here's Craig Mooney, my fiance is swearing in the background now, she's uh, just going nuts with that game. Bob Kudelski, Mikhail Teratinov, Pat Jablonski, Craig Wallon, Troy Loney, Bob Beers, we've had a couple of beers in this in this break. Uh, Steve Duchesne, Duchesne, sorry, Doug Gilmore, Bowman. Sergey Fedorov, a season leader. So he had 79 points. And he was the leading rookie. John uh, Agrodnik. There's a Jim Waite. And Kel Jill Samuelson. Kel Jill Samuelson. Of course, Bowman has to make things all complicated. So Phil Bork. Jacques Cloutier. Larry Robinson. Those are all junk. Right there. Mike Palmatier. Great to the game. That's cool. Here's a Pascal Leclerc. Pascal Leclerc. Patty Kane. That's cool. Patrick Kane. Uh, SP Authentic. 910. Patrick Kane. Marcus Nazant. Beehive. Pretty cool. That's from the uh, 05 06. Sidney Crosby's rookie year. Uh, Colton Parieko. <laughs> wow, that was an epic fail. Vladimir Tarasenko, I thought it was Colton Perico for whatever reason. So, Vladimir Tarasenko, SP Authentic. Here's Arturi Lekkonen, Thomas Shabbat, and Logan Couture, MVP. Uh, okay. Jonathan Marshall, Charlie McAvoy, Nicholas Jarmusen, we have, okay, it's Eric Halla, Nikolai Habibulin uh, from Trilogy, that's pretty cool, from uh, 07 08 Trilogy, Nikolai Habibulin, the Bulin Wall. We have Thomas Bokun from 07 08 OPG, we have, right here we have Rick Nash, Bill Hick, Bill Hickey. And just some um, more Bowman. Can I rip this? No, 
Doesn't want to be ripped. There we go. Yay! As I flick it to the side. Okay, we have Bill Bork. You were in that last pile, were you not? Same of you two. Like, just a bunch of irrelevant Bowman cards. Uh, the old ver like, 12, 13 score is this, like, modern version of Bowman. Just mass produced in these repacks. <laughs> Mark Grigg. Uh, there's a Kevin Stevens. Pretty cool, Kevin Stevens. We're going to have to flip these around because I do not want to spend time flipping. That's cool. Darren, McCart Darren McCarty, rookie. I heard he's a really nice guy. Uh, yeah, I remember him from uh, when he scored the hat trick uh, in the playoffs on Mother's Day back in 1997. Uh, that was pretty cool. And then he was, well, he played a pivotal role in the uh, Red Wings rivalry with the Colorado Avalanche of the late 90s. So, good hockey right there. Just YouTube some of those highlights if you haven't seen any. Oh, the, some of my favorite hockey just, oh, it was intense. Uh... Anatoly Semenov, here's a uh, Randy Gregg Pro Side 9, so he was a licensed physician, Randy Gregg, Kevin Stevens again, Chris Chelios, we have Robert Cron, and Sir Dirkowitz. I think we went, no, there's a Grand Fuhrer, so I thought we went through all these, but it's just a bunch of doubles, Grand Fuhrer. Jim Sandlack, uh, these terrible cards. Walker, no former NHL players. I'm not even going to say their name. We have... Okay, this is cool. Let's see, what do we have here? We just got a bunch of cards that are need to be flipped around. And then to finish us off, Philip Forsberg. Ryan Smith on the LA Kings. Dennis Weidman. Uh, there's Ken Hodge. Peter Doris, sorry. Um, that might be a mistake. I don't know if that's Peter Doris or, yeah. Forte, uh, Wilkie, Terry Karkner, Patrick Sundstrom. Here's a Milan Hayduke. Alex Ovechkin. Uh, that's cool. From, uh, 9-10, uh, MVP. And then we finish off with Chris Derno and Alexander Burles. Okay, everyone, so thanks for watching. Hopefully uh, you weren't too bored by that. Um, yeah, <laughs> and if you were, I don't blame you one bit. So thanks for watching. Uh, leave a like, comment, and subscribe, and stay tuned for more. I'm going to show you one or two random Iginla cards here from the pile. Just, you know, random, uh, just grab some random cards and see what I have in the Iginla collection. I am selling my Iginla collection. Uh, there's like... Two or three hundred cards there, so I'm gonna sell them for cheap. If you're interested, just message me. So here's the Jerome McGinley rookie anthology. Here's a 0607 Jerome McGinley. Here's a Ultra Flare Ultra Gold Medallion of Jerome McGinley. Uh, face off. Here's a Victory Game Breakers of Iggy. There we go. Some very really cool Go Go Rush from 0708 Upper Deck. Series 2. Here's a really old card. Some of these aren't the greatest shape, unfortunately. Uh, 0102 Tops on the game. Jerome McGinley for goals. So that's when he tied with, uh, yeah, he led with 52 goals that year. There we go. This uh, weird card. I never was a fan of these. Warriors of Ice. Too cartoonish and just made no sense whatsoever. Yeah, here's some interesting info over right here on the back. Iginla, whose father is Nigerian and whose mother was born in Oregon, was born and raised in Edmonton. So he was born here in Edmonton, uh, up in St. Albert, technically. His last name means Big Tree in Yoruba, his father's native tongue. Iggy was also a talented baseball player and was a catcher for the Canadian national junior team in his youth. So that's pretty cool. Here's a... He dropped a card. Here's a SP, uh, X, X, SP Excitement of Jerome McGinley, 169 out of 999. And then uh, 
Here's a really cool one. This is one of those uh, Frozen in Time drawing guns. So I remember I, I had a few of these, but I held on to the Jerome McGinley. Uh 214 out of 799. So that's pretty nice. Uh, against the Glass Jerome McGinley from 1011 Contenders. There's a Jerome McGinley. Go Celebrations. Jerome McGinley. 499 out of 500. Great Outdoors. I was at this hockey game, so I might just hold on to this card. But that's a really nice acetate card from Dunruss Elite, E1112. And here is the uh, MVP, Silver Script. Uh, all of these cards had the uh, facsimile signature, so it's not really an insert, it's a base, but really cool. Um, MVP, I wish they had MVP like this again. Uh, I prefer I prefer this MVP design to the modern, so that's just me. Okay, everyone, that's enough of me. So thank you so much for uh, watching, and uh, yeah, thank you. So I should have had this in the background the whole time, but my Instagram hobby reflections email jd underscore one nine two one three three at hotmail dot com. There's my Facebook. Leave a like, comment, and subscribe and share my videos and content. And I will do follow for follow on YouTube and Instagram YouTube and Instagram. And uh yeah. Uh Twitter I will be setting up very, very soon. So just to get some more stuff going. So okay everyone, thanks for watching. I apologize if the video went blurry there. I've been I'm I'm so focused on the cards I don't even pay attention. So, okay, everyone, uh, you didn't miss much anyway if it was out of focus. <laughs> so, just in case uh, you missed it, there was the trilogy uh, Frozen in Time. That was probably one of the better cards that I showed in this video. Okay, everyone, thanks for watching. Enjoy the rest of your evening, and I will catch you all later. Bye.